another one and I hope that you are really liking these paintings as well as much as I do so she is basically just kneeling on the floor and she will reach out for some raindrops that fall down from a big leaf and I try to really keep this jungle feeling of the painting like it's really in, in the forest, deep in the forest and, and I will try to create some rainy feeling, some raindrops
is gray and try to really make it a lot more darker there we go there you go a bit more of this dark really dark color yeah i like it much better much better like this Thank you. 
some little moss overgrowth here on this old tree. Just to keep it a little bit of a, of a jungle feeling or deep forest feeling. I start to add some little highlights with my white gouache to the leaves just to start to work on the little rainy effect on this painting so just to do water lines some little highlights and there we go I take some white gouache and just some little water lines here and there
some highlights to these little grassy areas just a bit there we go and some water is flowing on these little leaves as well I use my lighter brush and just some little raindrops I hope I won't ruin the whole painting with this little move There we go, a bit more A bit more of these little raindrops I'm struggling to paint a straight line with this liner brush as it can see But whatever I think it's visible what it's intended to be satisfied how this little lizard looks so far later on I will try to fix it a bit more but for the moment I let it dry as well. I need to be really careful because when the white quash dries it really loses a lot of its uh, opacity and it's not so visible anymore and so I really need to paint it over and over again. when I have the tendency to overdo things but I try to really just keep it simple and easy so let's see just some little highlights try to add some reflections to the ground but because it's a rainy it's a rainy painting and the ground is really wet as well so we can see some reflections
visible, it's not too detailed to be the messy, to be honest. I'm not saying that this little lizard looks retarded, but it certainly has more chances for survival in this painting than in an actual jungle. But I think I will let it be like this. He has really crazy eyes. I decided to add a bit more texture to this to this old tree, so I paint some highlights on this side. I think we are almost finished with this painting. I just keep adding some little details here and there, but basic concept is already done. Look at the face of this little lizard. It's crazy. Look at that face. <laughs>